An interesting way to visualize data is using geographical maps. In this video, you'll learn how to build map visualizations using GeoData. To add a map to a dashboard, you can either click the Create New Maps button or click on All Types and select Maps. Either way, this brings you to an empty base map. On the right side, you'll see an Add Layer button that allows you to add layers to the map. There are different kinds of layers. For example, you can visualize the location of individual records or plot them as heat maps. You can also plot data based on country or region names. Let's start by visualizing individual records called documents in the Elastic Stack. Click on Documents. Kibana asks you what indices you want to visualize. Once you've selected an index, you can specify the geospatial field. If you click Add Layer, you get additional configuration options for this layer. For example, you can give the layer a name. You can configure that this layer should only be visible to certain zoom levels. Now the documents only become visible when you zoom in. Click Save and Close to save this layer. Let's add another layer, now based on countries instead of coordinates. Select Choropleth to shade regions on the map based on your weblog traffic. For boundary source, select World Countries to visualize the boundaries between countries. Once you've selected your shading layer, you can select the format your join field is in. For statistic source, select the indices you want to visualize and the join field in those indices that contain two-letter country codes. Let's give this layer a name and only make it visible at certain zoom levels again. Now you see all the countries that occur in your data. Darker shades mean countries with more weblog traffic, while lighter shades mean countries with less traffic. You can choose your preferred coloring style. For example, you can use a grayscale to fill in countries and orange to draw the borders. You can also choose to display or not display access statistics for each country. We now have two layers visible at different zoom levels. While zoomed out, we see countries, and as we zoom in, we see individual documents. Let's save the map and add it to the dashboard. You can now resize the map and place it where you want on your dashboard. In this video, you learned how to get started with visualizing geodata on a map. Want to learn more? Visit the Elastic Quick Starts page to learn how to get started with one of our solutions for free.